Okay, try again. I did start the video, but I was getting some marking up on top of one of the rods. Didn't have the insulation up high enough, so we're going to start again. Alrighty. Second uh, test with this unit. What I've done this time is I've simply placed a solar panel right next to the glass jar to measure some sort of light output, see if it's a um, usable source of light. Bit of an idea slider through my way that uh, made me think of the solar panel as I don't have a light meter or a luminance meter to run. The water is going to be a bit warm. It is 33 degrees Celsius. Now, our amount of water in there is 2.1 litres this time, just simply so I can get a longer run. Um, we are in fact going to reset our watt meter and put it back onto the watts measurement. Okay, our solar panel is hooked across a 100 ohm 5 watt resistor. This meter here is hooked across that resistor. This meter here that's reading negative at the moment is hooked across the caps on the full wave bridge rectifier. Now that would indicate to us that a positive charge is being developed around our cathode, which is our iridium probe, and the negative, of course, being the anode in the reverse fashion. Okay, so we'll uh, light her up. Six millivolts. Uh, volts, should I say? No, it actually is millivolts. So, uh, nothing across here yet. But we do have some noise. And this is the RF, I think we've been looking at. Watt 
don't have hardly any voltage at all. Finger on the button, and I'll uh, 175 millivolts. That's the solar panel. The, the uh, solar panel didn't produce very much at all. Very, very small amount. There's a little stick sitting there for a minute. Now, like I said, we've got 2.1 litres of water here this time. A larger volume and pretty much well all the glass as well. Oh, that's a little warmer than expected. But we started off on a high temperature, so uh, but we also have more volume. Okay. Seventy-five degrees. Four and a half. That's right down the bottom. That's far down as I can go. Get close to it doesn't matter. And we have uh, 75 and a half. So I would say 75 degrees. Um, from 100 watt hours at 2.1 litres of water and of course our glass as well. So um, as far as light output that the solar panel can use it's not very good and um, but it did heat up a little bit more than I thought it would. So uh, we'll go back and crunch some numbers and we'll uh, post the video.